Hello everyone and welcome back to Splash. Today we're going to be talking about five awkward Ellen moments on the show. Number five, that unlucky audience member. A popular saying goes like this, there is enough love in the world to go around. Ellen is probably one of those who agree with this as she expresses her love and goodness to those within her reach. In 2018, Ellen put up a sign in a gift shop where she told her audience members who went there to take one free gift item from the shop. Unknown to them, there was a secret camera that recorded all of that transpired during that time. Eventually, the cameras proved useful. Most members of the audience stuck to the rules and picked only one item. However, one woman didn't, and of course, the camera took record of that. Did her take of Ellen's goodwill cost her? Well, it did, because Ellen made sure that people knew that she wasn't one to be easily fooled. This was an awkward moment for this young lady. In the show's episode that followed the incident, Ellen publicly addressed the issue by showing the camera's recording, and even went as far as pinpointing the guilty woman in the crowd. How embarrassing! Later on, the woman tried to justify her actions by explaining that she took two items because her sister, who was supposed to come to get her item herself, couldn't make it. So she thought she would get it for her. Hello. I... <laughs> What's your My name? My sister couldn't come, so that was her souvenir. Yeah. <laughs> Still, Ellen put her foot down with no excuses for the woman's actions, and it is definitely not an everyday sight to see the TV host go off on one of her audience members. Number 4. Cardi B's Baby Making Position Cardi B is a female American rapper, songwriter, and television personality. The Grammy Award-winning singer was recognized by Forbes to be one of the most influential rappers of all time. She is also popular for her blunt attitude and song lyrics, and certainly is not up for any form of nonsense. Cardi has shown this side of her on different occasions. When she once stopped by Ellen's TV show, she happened to have been heavily pregnant. Ellen and Cardi talked about anything and everything, including a tutorial on how to say R's in Cardi style, and the two also talked about Cardi's inability to drive despite owning a number of cars. That must have been a conversation. However, things got even more awkward when Cardi's pregnancy was discussed. It looks like you're getting ready to give birth right there. It looks like... But you know, they said the, the more you move, the easier it will come out. Ellen sang praises of Cardi being able to deliver a record-breaking stage performance when she was only six months pregnant. Talk about Wonder Woman! When a scene at Cardi's performance where she dipped low where their legs came apart on the screen, Cardi excitedly told Ellen that it was that position that she got pregnant. Too much information? I was just trying to show the world how I got pregnant in the first place. I see. I see. Well, Cardi never lets a boring moment stay around her. Number 3. Magic Mike Strip Tease the Ellen DeGeneres Show is a family-friendly show that anybody can watch, including kids. There is hardly anything that goes on there that is considered scandalous. They do their best to make sure of this. However, in 2016, Ellen invited Channing Tatum to the show, and it was sort of a promotion for Tatum's movie, Magic Mike. During the show, Ellen announced that there would be a preview of the movie on the show, and it will be happening live. I think this is the moment we're all waiting for. It's time for a little preview of Magic Mike live. And a member from the audience was asked to volunteer, and when she came to stage, she was given a jaw-dropping strip tease by the male dancer. Before things could get too hot, Tatum stopped the dance so it didn't get overboard for daytime television, but Ellen had other plans. Seconds later, the studio became full of half-naked dancing male strippers. Imagine the shock on Tatum's face as well as the audience's. These male dancers certainly work their stuff while filling the audience's eyes, and you can imagine the reaction from the ladies on the show. There was one elderly woman who's particularly intrigued by it all. Ellen surely helped Tatum promote his movie with that act, didn't she? Number 2. Hillary Clinton's Nay Nay One of the best segments of Ellen's show is where we get to watch celebrities make fun of themselves and try out new things on the show. It always leaves us coming back for more of Ellen's antics, and a lot of celebrities try out different dance moves here and there. While watching celebrities get pranked and try out new dance moves can be thrilling and fun, it certainly isn't anything to compare with watching former first lady and presidential candidate Hillary Clinton learn how to dance Nay Nay from Salento's Watch Me. Now that was golden. 
Ellen probably wanted to appeal to the younger generation with this segment. She had a professional dancer, Twitch, come onto the show to give her and Clinton a dance tutorial. The sight of watching the two women try to bust a move to gravitate towards the younger audiences was as hilarious as it was awkward. It isn't every day you get to have someone of Clinton's rank and status do the Nene dance. Number 1. Adele and the Hidden Earpiece Prank Adele is a British songstress who is very popular around the world for her incredible voice and award-winning song. The Grammy award-winning singer and songwriter is known to be down to earth and does not often appear on TV shows, it's all just part of her appeal. When comedian and TV host Ellen DeGeneres managed to get her on the TV show, she unleashed what she had been cooking up to make Adele's visit worthwhile. She got Adele to do the hidden earpiece prank, where she had to go into a nearby store and listen to Ellen's instructions through a hidden earpiece. Allison is going in, she's pretending to be Adele's assistant, she's going to say her name is Simone and she wants Adele to be treated like a regular person. She was to say and do everything that Ellen told her to do over the earpiece. Now you can imagine the shock on the faces of the members of the staff of the local juice bar when Adele just strolls right in casually. With her awkward demands, they did their best to provide what she needed. Okay, I'll take a large but in a small cup. I'll take a large. Okay. So can I have in a small cup? Large in a small cup. Yeah. Yes, please. Is um, that gift? With the straight face Adele had on while carrying out the act, she would have won a Golden Globe Award for it. It was really a memorable moment. As if the awkward demands Ellen had her making to the juice bar's attendance were not enough, Ellen had the singer take out a pair of scissors from her bag and cut some wheat grass from the counter before chewing on it like an absolute herbivore. Ellen herself was completely stunned that Adele could pull through with it. She could barely contain her laughter. Surely this would be one of the show's episodes that would be hard to forget. Also, while you are here, go ahead and check out the other two videos that are on your screen.